Now it is getting cooler outside, but that doesn't mean camping comes to a stop in Colorado. Joining us now is 5280 Magazine Editor Lindsay King to talk about the Beginner's Guide to Cold Weather Camping. Lindsay, good morning. Good morning. So why did you guys decide to uh, tackle this? Are that many people interested in cold weather camping? Right, it's kind of a funny thing to think about doing if you're not super kind of hardcore camper, but really in Colorado, this is an amazing thing to go do. And especially as our population has increased, summer camping is a little bit dif more difficult to find those really beautiful isolated spots and that is not a problem in the winter. Yeah, that's for sure. And uh, everything can be so beautiful in the winter too. Did you actually go camping in the winter for this story? I actually did. And I actually also took what's called winter camping school. So I did this for like six weeks. I did classroom work and actually went out into the field with the Colorado Mountain Club, which is a really wonderful resource if you are interested in something like this. They're located in Golden and they give different kinds of classes for different kinds of outdoor activities, including cold weather camping. Yeah, who knew? Um, so what were some of the biggest takeaways for you? Yeah, we talked to a lot of different veteran campers and um, really the biggest things is you have to be prepared. So in the summer, you can kind of get away with being a little lackadaisical in the winter. You can't. You need to bring the right gear. You need to know how to use that gear. You need to understand what happens to your gear when it gets really cold. Um, so are there things you really need to learn before you go out there? It's not really just kind of like a thing that you do at the last minute. What are some of the uh, what are some of the best uh, outdoor camping places to go in the winter? Yeah, you know, you have to really think about where you're going to go. Obviously, we don't have a lot of snow yet, but you need to make sure that you're not going to be in an avalanche area. You need to make sure there are actually some flat spots to be able to pitch a tent. But here locally, what's kind of cool for something that's really easy is White Ranch Park in Jeffco Open Space actually allows winter camping. It's permitted, but obviously you're lower elevation, so it's not as cold. But some other places up on Berthed Pass are really great. Um, the uh, Second Creek Trail is wonderful. So there's plenty that's within about an hour of, of Denver, which you might not think about either. It looks like a, a terrific article. When does the uh, when does this issue come out? If it's not already on newsstands, it should be there any day now, and it will go up on 5280.com um, on the first of the month. All right, Lindsay King, appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you.